Okay, so I have to kind of like sit on the ground today because of our video setup. Okay, so today we are going to learn something really, really cool, and that is this. You know how there's all these equations? There's so many of them that you have to learn. Guess what? what? You're only going to have to learn half. Yeah. You know why? Because of the commutative property of multiplication. The commutative property is so cool because it cuts the number of equations that you have to learn pretty much in half. Um, it says the order of numbers doesn't matter in your equation. So for example, three times four is the same as four times three. Let's see how this works, okay? So let's just say I have one, two, one group of two, two groups of two, three groups of two, and four groups of two. So this is four times two. See, two, that's one time. Two, that's two times. Three, two times three, and two times four. Two times four is how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But guess what? Watch this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Look at that. Eight. That's right. Four times two is the same as two times four. How many are there? There's still eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's still eight. You want to try another one? Okay. Let's do... So this is three times two. So that's three, two times, right? Mm -hmm. One, two, three, one, two, three. What if we change it to two, three times? One, two, three, four, five, six. It's the same. So the commutative property of multiplication says that the order of the number before the equal sign it does not matter. Two times three is the same as three times two. So that means since you already know the ones times table and the twos times table and most of the three times table because we did our song, right? You can actually fill in all the rest of them on your times table that are the opposite. So you can do one times one and one times two and then you can do two times one. And then you can do three times one, and four times one, and five times one, and six times one, all the way down the row. And we will see you in the next video.